My uh, realization that transition was a mistake was very, very sudden. The epiphany moment was, was the tension, the inner tension that that created. It just told me again, but that's because I wasn't born female. I didn't go through female socialization. I don't know how to interact with women the way that other women interact with each other. There's, there's really like deep aspects of being male that I can't bypass. Um, is this really something that I would want to be fighting against for the rest of my life? I had seen what I was really looking for in life and what I really wanted and realized that all of these steps that I was taking to try to somehow be my true self were actually taking me away from my true self, were actually taking away from who I was. It's been nine years, nine and a half years almost since, uh, since the surgery. When it comes to my mental health, I went for hell. I went hell and back. After that, I went through a period of addiction after um, my surgery, I think you know, for, for a long time, I was uh, just trying to uh, forget what happened. I'm at peace that I'm a man and I cannot change that. And I think of it as a biological uh, reality. In Norway, we don't really have a word for a detransitioner. Uh, there is a word uh, which means, uh, can be loosely translated to a regretter.